So for the last few years, there's been such a lot of exciting talk about reversing type 2 diabetes. This has really caught the interest of the press and so many of the public as well. Let's just talk about this for a bit. Uh, for me, even the word of reversal is a bit tricky. I actually believe that for most people, what we've really got is type 2 diabetes into remission. And I prefer the word remission to reversal because it's a reminder to all of us that if we go back to our sugary habits, then the, the diabetes will come back. But having said that, it's still a great message of hope that you can get your type 2 diabetes into a drug-free remission, not using any medication, and be perfectly well. I was looking back through my own figures and the longest I've got type 2 diabetes remission now in the practice is actually nine years. Uh, so initially I was told maybe it won't last, but that's nine years. Imagine how proud that, uh, that patient is. Um, I think so much of uh, the discussion around the subject of um, type 2 diabetes and reversal or remission uh, centers around the wonderful Professor Roy Taylor. Um, he's done brilliant work in Newcastle where he's actually been um, helping people lose significant amounts of weight and when that happens, as the pancreas and the liver lose fat, those organs begin to, to function better. I particularly like to highlight um, a paper that Roy Taylor wrote which galvanised really the whole world around the subject of, of type 2 diabetes remission. This was a paper he wrote in September, I think it was 2017, beating type 2 diabetes into remission. And that says it all. Um, it started a wonderful movement uh, where healthcare professionals are joining with motivated patients. And it's surprising how many people are getting type 2 diabetes remission. I actually, there are, there are different uh, ways of describing remission. I favour Roy Taylor's uh, view, which is type 2 diabetes remission is um, classified as you've got a haemoglobin A1c of under 48 millimoles per mole, sustained for six months, not using drugs. Uh, other people would disagree, but that is the, the, um, the definition I prefer. And using that definition in my own clinical practice, I'm getting nearly 50% of my patients into type 2 diabetes remission. I think that's a wonderful story of hope for us all. Uh, and imagine all those people, how proud they are.